Hey guys, I thought because Halloween is coming by in one month, I thought we would review some goosebumps. Now, I already um, opened this, haven't looked at the books just yet. I know what books are going to be in here, but it's like brand new, so... And I put them in order on which they came from. So, yeah. Um, I could see we have the Werewolf of Fever Swamp. Um, Stay Out of the Basement and the Cuckoo Clock of Doom. Then, over here, we got Piano Lessons Can Be Murder. The Cuckoo Clock of Doom again. Stay Out of the Basement. The Werewolf of Fever Swamp. And the haunted school. And then on the back, it's very really pretty. It's like a decoration. It has the big G on it. I got this yesterday in Barnold's and Nobles. Um, for $20. Pretty good. Okay, so let's open this up. It came with this little thing on the wrapping. Which basically tells you the books that you're going to get with it. Um, yeah. Now, the first book is The Cuckoo Clock of Doom. Um, and it's a pretty nice cover. Um, we have the bird popping out of the cuckoo clock. And it says, keep your eyes on the birdie. Yeah. I still have to read this one, but, and then, don't beat the clock. Pretty funny, um, yeah. So, yeah, that one has the first one. Then the second one is The Haunted School. It says, um, they, they watch, they're watching you learn the hard way. Um, Reminds me of when my mom says, you do it the easy way or the hard way. And then he's hearing um, voices from another world. I guess it's pretty scary, this one. Um, piano lessons can be murder. I already know the story. I started reading it a little bit. Lit again, hands. And the back says... Um, Practice till you drop dead. I think it's a pretty good book, actually. Piano lessons could be murder. So yeah. Then the second, the second book actually in the series is "Stay Out of the Basement." It says um something's waiting in the dark, and then the back says life lands dead people. So I guess that one's another scary one. Then last but not least, a very recognizable one is The Werewolf of Fever Swamp. Which I've actually never read and I'm going to read, so please don't get mad at me. And it says, um, who's afraid of the big bad wolf? <laughs> what big teeth you have? It's cool. I already have this Goosebumps collection over here. Um, I have the Goosebumps 2, um, Invasion of the Body Squeezers, a comic book, Night in Terror Tower, The Ghost of Slappy, Please Don't Feed the Weirdo, I'm Slappy's Evil Twin, Attack of the Jack, Slappy Birthday 2, my Life as a Writer from Marl Steins, the Special Edition, um, House of Horror, Dr. Maniac, um, The Haunted Mass, The Ghost Next Door, Welcome to Dead House, Revenge on the Living Dummy, and the actual two original ones I still have is You Can Scare Me and One Day at Horland. And yeah, it's a pretty good um, Goosebumps collection. Um, pretty decent, I'll say. And then over there, I put the sticker in which it came from. So, yeah, these are the five books. 
Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Now, the if I would pick two, I really, I re three, I really wanted to read is piano lessons, werewolf, and cuckoo clock of doom. These two are like meh. I know a lot of people love stay out of the basement, so I guess I'll read that one. But yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, please like and subscribe. You don't have to, but I would appreciate it. And bye, guys.